Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today in this video I will be showing you best driving test route at Castle Hill. So please watch this video 10 times. Don't do any mistake. You will get the license in one go. Thank you. So this is the driving testing parking. First of all, make sure the speed is 10 kilometers only. And there is a pedestrian crossing, so you have to be careful. Keep driving very slowly because this is a high pedestrian area. So make sure that uh, you are watching on all the direction because pedestrian may come from any direction. So just give an impression to the tester, driving tester that you are very cautious driver. This area parking space may be a little bit busy during the weekdays. So left from here. Just watch the traffic on the right. You are driving on Hudson Avenue. about take the left on Salisbury Road so now you are driving on the Salisbury Road and the speed limit is 50 km Two golden thumb rule is that don't feel yourself nervous and observation. Observation of the speed limit road signs. That is the two golden thumb rule. So now take left on Victoria Avenue. Give way to the traffic on the right. It is a busy roundabout. Again, uh, straight from the roundabout. Again, give way to the traffic on the right side. Keep driving straight. So, either of the two middle lanes you can see, we will be going straight from this uh, road. This is a red light safety camera. So you have to make sure that you follow that, don't jump. So this camera is for red light as well as speeding camera. So make sure you follow both the rules. This intersection is very busy, don't get nervous. So we are going straight. Speed limit is 60 km. So keep driving straight. Even if you are driving at uh, between 50 to 60 that will be okay but if you are driving 40 something it will be too slow and uh, it will be uh, going against you so keep driving between 50 to 60 so go straight from this roundabout again give way to the traffic on the right side So 
so it will be right from the Eric Cooper drive so change the lane shoulder check and this is the Eric Cooper drive so take right and give way to the traffic from the front so this is the quiet lane make sure you don't cross the double lane so here you may be asked to do the curbside parking here so just do the curbside parking give the left arrow signal and stop So curbside parking is done. So you tell the instructor that I have parked the car, put up the handbrake and then he will say you let's go. So drive straight from the roundabout, give the right indicator. We are driving on King's Road now. If you see the left lane is uh, just for the parking, so don't drive on that lane. So the speed limit, this is internal road, so it is 50 km. Always observe the speed limit. Safety of yourself plus safety of the other users on the road is very important. That is the key thumb rule to succeed. From the right roundabout, take right to the right road. This is no through road so especially these kind of roads are less traffic so they choose it for the reverse parking so now here behind this white car just we will do the reverse parking so don't get nervous it is easy give the left indicator check the all the mirrors Make sure you can see the wheels of the front car and park the car, tell the instructor that I have parked. So this is how you have to do the reverse parking. Okay, so let's take a U-turn. straight from the roundabout so this is the school zone must observe the school timings don't cross 40 kilometers speed limit during the school zone So these markings are indicating that there are pedestrian activities so you have to be very very cautious. And on the pedestrian crossing the speed limit will be around 20 kilometers. So go straight from the roundabout. straight from the traffic lights so school zone limit ends here so now it is 50 km zone so go straight again straight from the roundabout give way to the traffic on the right side Straight from the roundabout to Wrights Road. 
this is again a busy circle roundabout so you have to be careful because of the shopping center close by there may be some traffic don't get nervous straight from the roundabout so we are following the rights road keep going straight speed limit is 50 km make sure that all the internal roads have a speed limit of 50 km straight from the roundabout take left on the aroma avenue and do the three point turn here so do the three point turn give the right indicator check the mirrors traffic on the back and give the left indicator and again right indicator and left on the right street right road check the traffic on the right side and now take left on windsor road this road is very busy so must be careful about traffic from the right side don't get nervous so speed limit is 60 km if there is any road work speed limit in force then you must follow that you may find some of the drivers speeding but you are doing the test so make sure you follow that speed limit keep going straight take left to the showground road when you take left on this road make sure that there are traffic coming from the right side so you have to be very very careful so check your uh, right mirror and then uh, make sure that you are observing the traffic properly so give the left indicator first And as soon as you turn left give the right indicator because uh, he will ask you to take right So as you can see the traffic is coming from the right side So you have to observe traffic start giving the right indicator from here and this is a traffic merging don't cross these two lines after that wait for some second because if you cross these two lines it will be immediate fail so 
so don't get nervous you can change the lane here give the indicator people are very nice so the other drivers will definitely give you way because you are learner because you have to change uh, lane and you have to take right from the traffic lights so you have to change the lanes not only one lane but it will be two lanes so don't get nervous especially during the day time this especially intersection may be busy so don't get nervous you need to practice on this route at least 3 times then i am sure you can get the license in one go so again keep giving the right indicator so this is the right lane to li right lane keep to the right side again there is a red light and speed camera don't get nervous don't jump the traffic light when it is green line light then only you cross if it is a yellow just stop so take right on the victoria avenue and then take right from this roundabout give way to the traffic on the right side and follow the very slow speed limit here uh, you are facing the pedestrian crossing speed should be 20 km an hour must be careful about the pedestrian because their safety is must so slowly drive and then left to this parking area and you are back after giving this test hopefully you have done well good luck to you if you have any question just leave in your comments i will be happy to answer and best of luck for your driving test i hope guys you enjoy this video please leave your comments if you have any question and please subscribe to my youtube channel press the bell icon and share this video with the other people who are going for the driving test Thanks a lot